Hi everyone and welcome to the big picture review for TCM students. I'm recording this for TCM review online for both California um, licensing exam as well as NCC AOM exams. If you are a student preparing for your in-school exams or for your national or state exam, this is a short course that will show you a different and more efficient way to learn your big picture, something that will allow you to recall it faster and also to write it down faster um, to save you time during the test. You can typically whip this out in about five or six minutes if you're really practiced at it. So let's go ahead and get started. So if you already have a way of learning uh, the big picture, obviously you must be dissatisfied with it in some way or another. Maybe it takes you a long time to relearn. Maybe it's just a lot of phone numbers to learn and you're looking for a better way. So my reasons for telling you to learn it this way are number one, that you will have to memorize less. There are less phone numbers. In fact, there's really only two phone numbers to remember and a couple other other, other uh, pieces of information that you have to keep in mind in order to recall the entire exam. The other reason is that um, you're going to think less and while this might sound kind of silly, um, there's so much thinking that we have to do. There's so much information, formulas, herbs, meridians, theory, fundamentals, um, Western medicine, clean needle technique. There's so many things we really have to think about on this test. There's really no reason to spend that extra energy and space in your brain thinking about the big picture. So that is another purpose for this particular method of learning it. Um, my advice to you with this particular way of learning is to make this a game, right? Make this fun. This is something that if you spend a few hours on um, every day for about a week, I promise you, you make it something that's a challenge that you want to rise to, just make it fun and break it down in all the ways I'm explaining, you are going to find that um, you're never going to forget this again. Uh, one story that I told recently was that I had not done the big picture for about a year. I had taken my licensing exams, I'd been practicing um, in my own practice, private practice, wasn't doing anything school related, and I decided to take my national exams. And within about 10 minutes, because I still remembered the two small phone numbers I'm about to show you, I was able to recall the entire big picture. Okay, so it really does stick with you. It's, it's a very non-thinking way to remember it. So make it a game, make it fun, okay? Okay, so what is included in this version of the big picture? First, our antique and elemental points, uh, our back shoe and our front move points, our yuan, our low, and our g-cleft points, right? So this is the, m the, the mass amount of numbers that's on the big picture. There are other things, um, but, but this is the bulk of numbers that most people have a difficulty uh, recalling or memorizing um, for any long period of time. Okay, so that's what we're reviewing here. What is not included here? Not included here are the smaller um, groups of points, which I think are a little bit easier to remember, right? Because they are smaller and they're somewhat more familiar to most of us. So the eight extra and eight influential points, the exit and entry points, the command points, the lower Hasi, the group low, the muscle meridian, and the four Cs. So these are a part of the big picture, so I don't want you to get um, confused here. You do need to know these things for your big picture, but they are um, less complicated, a little simple, a little more straightforward, and really just require some of your time if, if you're not already familiar. Okay, so that is not included here. Okay, so the very first thing I want you to memorize before you do anything else, even if this is the only thing you do today, this is the phone number you want to memorize. And that is 854-547-565-4141-3860. Note both my change in tone as well as the directional change in the way I wrote this here. I would really encourage you to memorize it exactly that way. So when you say this in your head, you want to say 854-547-565. 4141 3860. Okay, and when you write it to yourself to learn it, write it this way. There is a method. Second thing to learn bladder or UB is unequal to 16, 17, 24, and 26. Number two. Number three. Last thing to learn here to, to uh, get your big picture down. You want to remember 7 6 and 6 7, and you want to remember 4 3. 
Now as a secondary note, you can ignore this here, or you can just make a mental note and jot these notes down exactly as I have them, is that connected to six and seven, you wanna skip two. Okay, that's just kind of a side note. Once you practice this, you'll remember it, but it's a side note. Okay, so let's get started. Now, once you've practiced it the way that I'm about to show you, this is what you're gonna end up with, right? So once you get the pieces down, this is what I want you to, to, for your final product to be. And this is a 13, 13 down by 13 across grid. And this 13 by 13 grid, you can print this out. This is available if you're taking the class or you can draw this out yourself. Um, this is gonna be the way you're gonna write it for your exam. So it's all in one box. I'm gonna do this at the end of the recording so you can see how quick and easy it is. But for the time being, what I want you to do is practice it using this. This is that same box, 13, 13 across, 13 down. Um, although on this we don't use the last boxes and you'll see why. Um, but broken into three parts. And remember I gave you th three rules, 854, 547, 565, 41, 41, 38, 60. Bladder is unequal to 16, 17, 24, 26, and then our 7, 6, 6, 7, and 4, 3. That's over here. Okay, so we're going to start on this one. You can also free, um, free draw this, but this is where I want you to start to learn it. Okay, so let's, let's go ahead and plug this in. So up here for learning purposes, let's write that phone number, 854-5. Five six five, forty one forty one, thirty eight sixty. Okay. So here, what you need to know is you need to learn the order of the organs. Now, this is going to be separated into two. So here, we're going to have our yin organs. Yin organs are going to go here. Yang organs are going to go here. Get a little weight for my paper here. Okay. So here, the order of the organs is what's most important. So here, it's mostly back shoe. There's just one little change with the, with the order of the organs in the yin um, order. So we're going to go lung, pericardium, right? That's back shoe order. Heart. Now here's where we have a little change. We're going to go spleen first, then liver, then kidney, right? So all of our yin organs, the only thing that's out of order in the yin um, Yin order on the back shoe is spleen and liver are switched. Now, down here below, you don't even have to remember. You're just going to match these to their yang pair in order. So lung is large intestine, pericardium is sanjiao, heart is small intestine, spleen is stomach, liver is gallbladder, kidney is bladder. Done. Okay. First thing to know. Now, these numbers here, these are your Jing rivers. They're the only ones that you have to memorize. Okay. So here we're going to have... Jing Well, Ying Spring, Shu Stream, Jing River, and Hussey. And actually, uh, I'm going to change that. We're taping live here, so let me just change that real quick. Jing River, Ying Spring, Shu Stream, Jing Well, Ying Spring, Shu Stream, Jing River, and Hussey. And then over here, we're going to put our organs. I'm used to writing it out by hand, not having this fancy grid, but you have it. Okay. Now, the other thing we know is that all yin organs, we know this, right? They all start with wood. So we're going to write that up here, wood, and then they go in the generating cycle order. So wood, fire, earth, metal, water, right? Okay. Down here below, we know all yang organs, that they start with uh, metal, right? So you see here we have this box. This is why we have 13 boxes total. Otherwise, we'd have 12 on all these. But this extra box allows us here to write in metal, because they all start with metal, then generating cycle, right? Water, wood, fire, and earth. Great. And we already know up here, these are all going to be Jing, Well, Ying Spring, Shu Stream, Jing River, and Hussey. All right. So... In go our Jing Rivers. This is our first phone number, 854-547, skip, 565, and here we go, 41, 41, 38, 
60. Great. Those are the only odd numbers that require real thinking. And you see here we already have an observation, right, that gallbladder, the earth point, um, the shoe stream point is kind of odd. So without even needing to remember that, we know from this phone number we have something odd here about that, right? It's just a sort of a mental note to make. Now, Hasiz, we don't need to memorize. Why? You don't need to spend extra time memorizing what you already know. Hasi points are all located at the knee and the elbow. These are points we know, these are points we needle, we don't have to memorize them. So we know that lung is five, pericardium is three, heart is three, spleen is nine, liver is eight, kidney is 10. We know large intestine at the elbow is 11, sanjiao is 10, small intestine is eight, stomach is 36, gallbladder is 34, and bladder is 40. Don't need to memorize, right? No point. Now, after this, just counting. Lung starts at 11, 10, 9. Pericardium, 9, 8, 7. Heart, 9, 8, 7. From here, we go into our threes. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Kidney, 1, 2, 3. Jump down to large intestine. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Okay, now we're down at stomach. This is the end of the channel, right? We know stomach has... 45 points. We know gallbladder has 44. Here we know bladder is 67. From here it's counting. 44, 43, 43. We already have our 41. 66, 65. Done. Biggest part of the big picture. What? A minute. And I did that slowly for you. So you can see how quickly you can get this. So this is the thing to focus on. You get this, the rest of it's done just counting. That's the phone number to learn. 854-547-565-4141-3860. Got it? Good. Okay. On to our back shoe. Back shoe and our front moo. And these are going to be our organs. And this is going to be in back shoe order here, okay? I like to do the numbers first because I relate to the numbers because I just know them that I, and then I'm able to match the organ up more easily. But the thing to remember, if you forget, is that bladder, right, is unequal to 16, 17, 24, and 26. So what this tells us is we're not going to write those numbers in here. It doesn't equal these. So we know our back shoe, right, starts at 13, 14. 15, no 16, no 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, no 24, 25, no 26, 27, and 28. We have an extra box here, and that's because of our empty slot here, right? 13 by 13 to make it easy to write. Now we're going to plug in our organs that go with this. Lung, pericardium, heart, liver, gallbladder, spleen, stomach, sanjiao, kidney, large intestine, small intestine, bladder. Great. Now, a little trick here with the front moo. Let's skip over these first two here. Right here we have three points. These are going to be known as our three fives. Then if we skip down to Sanjiao, we have three points here. These are going to be known as our three fours, right? This is where it kind of becomes a game. And you just have to remember these little rules that go with the game. Now, lung is a very easy front moo. Lung, if you can remember it, I know it's difficult, lung one, right? Easy. Pericardium, also another easy one. Ren 17, right in the middle of the chest. So these are, these are simple to remember. Now, our three fives. So here... Uh, I'm sorry, yeah, three fives. So here are three fours. Did I mix that around? I did mix that around. So three fours here. My game tells me it was wrong. And three fives here. Three fives. Okay, so up here at heart, we start at Ren 14. Liver, liver 14. Gallbladder is gallbladder 24. So here we have our three fours. 14. 14, 24, okay? Spleen, we should all know. Liver, 13, it's also the controlling point of the Zong organs. Stomach, we have a little game here. We have 21, we flip that to 12. Run 12, right? So there's your little trick there. 
Now, here we have our three fives. Sanjiao, a lot of people forget, that's Ren five. That's our first five. Kidney, another one people forget, that's gallbladder 25. We don't need all that a lot, but we know it's our second five, 25, and we have 24 here. So that's a Q for us, 24, 25. Large intestine we know is also a 25. What is it on the front though? Stomach, right? So it's the same number here. That makes it easy. So five, five, and five. Now, another little trick for our last two, Ren 5, if you remember your first 5 here, this counts down. So Ren 5, Ren 4, and Ren 3. Right? No thinking here. We're writing in our numbers, we're leaving out these numbers because we learned that with this little trick here. We have our 3 4s, 4, 4, 4, our 3 5s, 5, 5, 5, five. from our 5, 4, 3, Stomach, we flip it, 21 to 12. Spleen, you have to remember that, but I think we all know this, right? Liver, 13. It's not something we have to remember a lot. That's, that's a controlling point there. That controls the Zong organs. Up here, Ren, 17. Lung, 1. I think these are easy to remember. I don't think this requires a lot of memorizing, right? It's just getting used to writing this out. All right, on to the last part of our big picture here. This is where we have our 7, 6, 6, 7, and where we have our pattern of repeating four, three. Okay, now here, our order is gonna be Yuan, Lo, and Ji cleft. And I just like to remember that X marks the spot of the last box. Lo connects the two, which leaves us with Yuan. So Yuan, Lo, Ji cleft, that's the order you wanna know here, okay? And here, we're gonna go in the um, circadian clock order, right? So here, and, and by the way, um, this is all, um, well, you'll see when we do the big picture, so when we do the big grid there, so we'll just leave that for now. So this is gonna be circadian clock order. So this is gonna be yin yang pair, and then we go into the yang ming kind of thing. So lung, large intestine, now a yang ming, right? Stomach, yin yang pair, spleen, heart, small intestine, bladder, kidney, pericardium, san jiao, gallbladder, and liver. Right, and then again we have our empty box. Why? Because we added a 13th box for this empty box here, which is helping us in this part of the big picture. Okay, so now here, this is where we have our seven, six beginning. So we're gonna start up here, seven, six, and this is something you're just gonna memorize. The next box is six, seven. That's the only place you see that six, seven like that. The rest of them are all gonna be seven, six. Then, this is where we skip two. You're gonna skip the next two boxes. You come down to these two boxes here, and now you're into the heart. Now heart, you have to remember, is seven, six. When you come down into small intestine, we move over seven, six. Skip two boxes. This is the pattern that you wanna memorize first. Once you get down, that you have this little blip here, seven, six, that you skip two, and where you put these, these are the most odd numbers in this whole thing, but it's a pattern, right? Seven, six, six, seven, skip two, seven, six, seven, six, seven, six, seven, six, 37, 36. Now, the next pattern that I want you to learn is the one that goes with this four, three, four, three. And you can guess, probably, this is our Yuan point list here, and we're gonna skip every other box. So we don't go here, we go right to large intestine, four, skip, three. You want source points. Skip, four, skip, three. Skip, four, skip, three. Now, that doesn't leave us a lot to fill in here, and some of this may be intuitive for you, because you want source, right? They're mostly where? At the ankle or at the wrist. I just always remember that lung, I fill it in here, nine. It's a habit that I fill in. Stomach is my next habit. I, I'm just, it's something I've become familiar with. That's where I made it a game, right? So I know here at stomach, it goes 42. It connects with 40 and 34. 42, 40, 34. I'm just used to writing that. Spleen goes three, four, we count, and then we double four, makes eight. Heart, I just remember, five goes in between here. Our small intestine is done. Bladder's one of those weird ones, so I just kind of always remember. 64, 58, 63. So here I kind of remember 64, 63, counting down, and that 58's the weird one right in between. Kidney we count, three, four, five, easy. Pericardium, we have seven, six, four. 
Here, Sanjiao, if you notice, we put a five here, and what do we see? Four, five, six, seven. So that's just another little thing that I picked up on that helped me when I couldn't remember without having to think, right? Where's my four, five, six, seven? And I always remember it's right in here with my pericardium Sanjo. Gallbladder, uh, hopefully we know. Yuan source is 40. And liver, we count here three, but it's five, six, five, six. Done. There it is. There's our big picture. So let me show you how this works when you do it the long way. And let me make sure I have enough boxes here. Let's see. I think we do. Yeah, we do. Let's do this. Okay, so I'm not going to write it all out um, like I did before. I'm just going to start for you, okay? right here, yin yang. So now we have our yin yang. Yin separates first, lung, pericardium, heart, spleen, liver, kidney. We're going to skip one. We're going to match those, large intestine, to write those in there so you're not going to make this mistake I'm used to writing it out myself I'm used to not filling in those boxes okay now we've got our phone number where in the Jing River right here we go Just counting down, right? Nine, eight, seven. And now we're just counting all the way down to stomach. And here we have our 45, 44, 67. And then we just count. All right, and in here, we can write our generating cycle for yang. And up here, we know the yin organs start with wood. And you probably won't need to write this after a while, but when you're first starting, it's just, you know, it's, it's good. And I think it is good to, to continue to do it because, you, again, you want to think less on your tests. Okay, so here we have our back shoe order. I always start with my numbers. And we're going to do what? UB is unequal to. We know what that is. 16, 17, 24, and 26. Twenty-five, and remember these bottom boxes aren't going to get used so you don't want to freak out about that now we're going to match these with the organ right lung And then here, front move, right? We have our rules. So we know that lung is lung one. We know that uh, pericardium is REN 17. Now here we have our three fours, right? REN 14, liver 14, and gallbladder 24, our three fours.
fours. Spleen, we just remember, is liver 13. Stomach, we remember we switch, is Ren 12, 21 to 12. Sanjo is our first five, our first five of three fives. So here we're gonna have Ren five, and I automatically go right down here, Ren five, four, three, right? That's done. Now I have my other two fives. Kidney, it's a funny one, gallbladder 25. And our memory key for that is that we have gallbladder, gallbladder 24. And here we have stomach 25, right? The same number, LI, front move, stomach 25. Now, coming over here, this is our clock. Okay, and now we're going to do our 7, 6, 6, 7, and our 4, 3, right? So we're going to skip 2. 7, 6, 6, 7, skip 2. 7, 6, 7, 6, skip 2. Pericardium, 7, 6. Sandra, we have a funny one. 7, 6, 37. 36. I just remember Sanja is always weird, right? Okay, now we're going back up to large intestine. We have our 4-3 pattern. 4-3, we're skipping one. 4-3, skipping one. 4-3. I come right back up to lung. I know that's nine. Now stomach, I just remember. 42, 40 connects them. 34 is G cleft. Spleen, we count. Four, double that is eight. Heart, we remember, is five. Bladder, we know is funny, right? <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Counting three, four, five. <clears throat> Pericardium seven, six, four. Sanjo five. Here's where I have four, five, six, seven. Gallbladder's at the ankle, we know it's 40. Liver counting 5, 6. There you go, big picture. No need to take 20 minutes. No need to memorize a lot. Learn your phone numbers. 854 547 565 41 41 38 60. Bladder is unequal to 16, 17, 24, and 26. 7, 6, 6, 7, 4, 3. Make sure you skip the 2. Do this, I promise you, you will never forget it again. Good luck.